I never really known I had a sister until my dad passed away. Our dad passed away. And being an only girl, well, I knew I had a brother. I didn't care because it was a guy, right? <laughs> but when I found out I had a sister, I was thinking, I'm not the only girl anymore. But the first time I met you, Narito ang trending at usap-usapan pa rin na naging wedding message ni Senator Grace Po sa kanyang kapatid na si Lovie. Gayon din ang emosyonal na mensahe ng nakababatang kapatid ni Lovie na si Ella sa kanyang at. Pati na rin ang mga naging wedding vows ng couple sa katatapos lamang nilang garden wedding sa United Kingdom. Panoorin ang ilan sa mga naging highlights sa kasal ni Lovie Po. In this new chapter, I promise to always be by your side as your equal, to support your dreams and passions as my own, and to form a partnership built on honest communication, trust, and most importantly, love. With you, I promise to explore new adventures, celebrate the success that will come our way, and navigate challenges with strength, compromise, and resilience. <laughs> Lastly, even if I appear moody and grumpy, <laughs> especially in the morning, I promise that I always have and always will cherish every day spent. The man who sees my success as his success. The man who supports me and pushes me to turn my dreams into goals. More importantly, you have completely changed my perception about family, marriage, and love. I've always believed that picking a life partner isn't as simple as choosing someone's love. <laughs> it's about choosing someone who someday, if lucky enough, my future daughter will thank me for. So know the little discomfort of being 7,000 miles apart and having a 16 hour time difference is not gonna let me down. I want this life with you and I'm going to make it work. I promise to always choose to make it work. <laughs> I promise to always be by Ladies and gentlemen, I give you a happy couple, Lovey and Monty. Yeah. never really known I had a sister until my dad passed away, our dad passed away. And being an only girl, well, I knew I had a brother, I didn't care because it was a guy, right? <laughs> but when I found out I had a sister, I was thinking, I'm not the only girl anymore. But the first time I met you, during the wake, I saw a really young, innocent child weeping for our dad. And I felt so sad. And I felt so maternal. I could say maternal because Lovey is just a few years older than my own son. So I felt at that time, not only had I gained a sister, I almost felt like I had another child. Because I see new qualities of the father I really love. In person, you're generous with your time, with your kindness. You are disciplined. <laughs> you are very modest. And you are not conventional. You are not into what other people will do what other people wear, what other people purchase, you have to have the same thing. No, you're independent-minded. And 
in our in our uh, lobby stayed briefly at our place in LA. And as I was cleaning some stuff in the house, this was a few years ago, like maybe four years ago, you were already practicing writing the last name of Monty. Oh wish he could have walked you down the aisle. I just really wish. He would have been so proud of you. You're beautiful. You're very intelligent. And you're strong. I know you can weather anything because you are the daughter of FPJ. <laughs> Deep emotions and tears of joy that reflect the enduring commitment he vowed to.